Good morning. What is going on, Skywalker Army? You know who this is. The real one. Always controversial. Gabriel Skywalker here with another NBA DFS video. Well, we actually have a two-game slate today, guys. But I don't know. I was kind of liking those showdowns. We had a damn near takedown yesterday with those showdowns, man. We killed it. Absolutely crushed it. It was a great day for, DF for Skywalker DFS yesterday. So if you aren't in that free chat, you missed out. Now, you're asking yourself, what is this free chat? What is he talking about? So, to get in this free chat, which I think I'm the only one in the industry that does this. All right, everybody else charges for it. To get in this free chat, which consists of my lineups, which consists of the DFS Club, the DFS Whispers, LJ Sports, DFS Space, and myself. So, you get my free lineups. You get the DFS Club popping in there from time to time, giving you free advice. My lineups, their advice... How can you go wrong? All you have to do to get in that chat is subscribe to my channel. Hit me up on Twitter. I'll leave my Twitter handle in the description below. And you're in. That's it. 100% free. It's just my way of saying thank you for your subscribing. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of this month, guys. That's my goal. So it's just my way of saying thank you guys for subscribing. So get in there. Get in that free chat. You're missing out on all the free content. We got MLB. We got NBA, we got tennis, we got golf, we got freaking kick, we got every sport. We got like 200 people strong in there, guys. It's blowing up. We're taking over this industry for the better, guys. We're making it, we're making it good. We're making it honest. You know what I'm saying? So 100% free, guys. Check it out. And speaking of more free shit, Draft Dashboard is sponsoring a free $10 giveaway this month every Sunday. So every Sunday, we're going to do a $10 giveaway sponsored by our friends at Draft Dashboard. So look out for that. In order to qualify, all you got to do is subscribe to my channel and leave a comment below. That's it, guys. And you're in for that $10 drawing. All right? Draft Dashboard is the best lineup, or not just lineup, but the best optimizer on the planet, guys. With that, I'm offering it to you for $1 for 30 days. And... I know, what are you guys going to do when NBA is over? I know you're not going to sit around all summer and wait for NBA. To, you're going to want to play DFS. So, MLB is the only thing pretty much you got going. You got WNBA coming up. And so, you're going to need Draft Dashboard. I'm going to need Draft Dashboard. Right now, I'm doing baseball, and I need it. I'm offering it to you for $1 for 30 days, guys. That is it. In order to get Draft Dashboard for $1 for 30 days, all you have to do is click in the, in the link below in the description. I'll leave. Click on that link. You're in for $1, guys. With that dollar, you get access to my save lineups. You get access to my watch players. You get access to the lineup optimizer, which killed it yesterday in that showdown slate. We ran 100 lineups or whatever, and then I did the quarters. Some guys did the dollars, and we, we just took it all down. Took it all down. So this is more of an investment, guys. And it consists of my watch players, your watch players, and who Draft Dashboard thinks you should play, guys. You got your player trends. Who's trending up and who's straight fucking the dog? You got your sleepers and studs. You got your position optimizer, which breaks down every single player. You got your top DFS players of the day. You got your NBA cheat sheet. Because if you can't win, cheat. And that cheat sheet is there for all sports on Draft Dashboard. All right, guys? One dollar for thirty days. Thirty days. Ha! <laughs> thirty days. Here we go again. I normally do these videos at night, and I still can't get it right. I thought maybe I'll do it in the morning; it'll be better. But I'm still fucking up. So it looks like everybody's probable today. Austin Rivers is questionable, but we'll see. We shall see. So let's go to my watch players. Let's see what's happening. All right, I got a lot for you guys today. So. Off the tops, we'll get the studs out of the way. We got Jokic. I ain't got to tell you about Jokic. Um, 47. He So his his floor is a 47. He got his floor the last game. Jokic, big honey. DFS space calls him fat boy. I call him, you know, the Joker, like everybody else. He got so many nicknames. But look for him to come back angry. He's going to hit the... the uh, the buffet before he gets there, so he'll be nice and fucking ready to go. He'll be energized. I'm looking for a 79.80 out of Jokic today, guys. Next up, we got Giannis. Giannis is back to Giannis. He got a 56 last game. 
Third game before that, 38-67. It's starting to get real now in the series, guys. So look out for these studs. They're going to go all out. I think Giannis probably gets a fucking 70 tonight, guys. So we can't hide from these guys. We just can't. Then we're looking for consistency. Next up, we got Middleton. Mr. Consistent in this series. 41 of 40. Last two, first two games of the series. Um, <clears throat> she's only 6'8". You got to get Middleton in there, guys. Got to get him in there. Next up, for 3-6, you got to have the value. All right, I'm trying to give you guys some value now. So, Mason Plumley. I don't know how you can't ever roster this guy. His floor is a 7. The ceiling is a 42. He does have a 42 against Portland. So... Last two games, 18-27. So you know that 42 is coming. All right? Next up, we got Paul Millsap. Old man Millsap. But you know what? He's got, with that old age, he's got experience. He's, especially he's got playoff experience, guys. 37-32 in his last two. He's only 5-6. You got to roster Millsap, guys. You got to do it. Next up, we got Marcus Morris. Another one. 31-26. and 26. He's only 4-6. He's been showing out in the playoffs, guys. He's, I, I think he's he's been showing out more than Kyrie, to be honest with you. Then next up, we got Malik Beasley for 3-8. If you're looking for value, there you go. There's Malik Beasley. If he's constantly at 3-8, if he's getting you 20 or more fantasy points like he has been in the last two games, you got to roster him, dude. You got to roster Malik Beasley. And next up at 3-3, he's back. Will Barton, guys. We got a 21 last game. I think he's going to get a 30 or more this game, guys. That's just a hunch. That's, that's a gut feeling, but I think he's going to get there. Will Barton at 3-3, uh, three, three, you guys. Get him in there so you can fit more studs in. Next up, we got C.J. McCollum at 6-6. 37-28 six, six, last two. Um, history against Denver, period. It's pretty consistent. 37-28, 28-0, 27 I'd probably look for maybe a mid-30 point game to 40 points out of McCollum today. And at 6'6", six, six, we'll take a 40 point game. Then we got Terry Rozier. Like, he sounds like a goddamn chocolate. You know, like a, Ro a Terry Rozier chocolate. Come and get it. 24-28, uh, last two. At 4-2, if he gets a 28, hell yeah. Even if he gets a 30 at 4-2... Nice. And then we got Gary Harris. I like him because he gets the minutes, guys. He gets 38 to 40 minutes a game. Um, he only got a 17 and a 26 last game. But if he's getting fucking that many minutes, he's going to... You know Gary Harris. He knows what his ceiling is. He's going to have a breakout game. And I don't want to be sleeping when he has that breakout game. Because then your, your lineup is dead. And he's only 4'9", guys. You got the salary. I mean, you got the room. Get him in there. Same with Meritick, guys. He's only 3'9". He got a 32 and 20 in his first two. As you can see, look at his points. They're trending upwards, 7, 15, 18, 20, and then up to 32 because you got the start. Look for that trend to keep going up, guys. And at 3-9, Miritic, got to get him in there. He'll probably be chalk, but probably be good chalk. Then at 3-9, Rodney Hood, 26-22 in the last two games. Anything in the 20s at 3-9 is good, guys. He gets another 26. We'll take it all day long. And then last but not least, Pat Connington. Again, 3-7. I'm trying to find this value for you guys best I can. 23 last game. Looks like he might be back to form. Um, if he gets anything, again, at 3-7, anything over a 20 is great. All right? So let's go check out this lineup optimizer. Let's see what it gives us today. So here we go. Let's see what we got. So these are all from my watch players, guys. So... He gave us C.J. McCollum, Terry Rozier, Giannis, Marcus Morris, Jokic, Rodney Hood, Chris Middleton, Will Barton. Look at that lineup. I'll save that right now. That's a great lineup, guys. Feast your eyes on that. All right. There you go. All for free. If you guys want more free lineups, again, to get in that chat, all you got to do is subscribe to my video, hit me up on Twitter, and you're in. All right. Let's get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of the month, guys. Just Please help me get you there. If you can help me get you there, I'll get you in that free chat. That's it. All right, y'all. Let's eat today. Let's feast. We only got a little bit of time left before this NBA season is over. So let's, let's feast while we can. Let's get that bread. Let's get that money. And like I always say, don't take shit from nobody. Happy Friday, y'all. Let's get it.